Hello, my name is Tatiana, and I am a research engineer on Gemma, working on model pre-training. Today, I want to show you a demo that uses Gemma's multi-turn, multi-modal, and long context capabilities. We recently launched Gemma 3, and it now handles context windows up to 128,000 tokens, and this is 16 times more than Gemma 2. Let's test the long context now. The Royal Society has recently published the list of most popular papers of 2024. These are the papers that gained the most attention and engagement, and I am very interested to learn what they are about. However, I don't have the time to read all of these papers, so I will use Gemma 3 as a research assistant to help me learn more about them. First, I will pass the papers to the Gemma model, and I will ask it to summarize each paper with a single sentence. This will help me choose which paper I want to learn more about. I am particularly interested in the paper about humpback whales, so I am going to ask the model to briefly summarize the key points. And as you can see, Gemma is able to give me a good summarization of the paper. However, there is a term here that I don't recognize, bellwethers. Let me ask Gemma what exactly it means in the context of the paper. OK, so the term is a metaphor. The humpback whale's population can serve as an indicator of changes in the ecosystem resulting from climate change. This sounds very interesting. Are there any other papers that discuss similar topics? And here, you can see that Gemma not only listed similar papers, it also summarized each one of them and described their connection to climate change. I am a dog person, so one paper that caught my attention is the one about dogs. Let's ask Gemma to describe the key finding of that paper. Oh, so these dogs are able to remember the names of objects for two years. How fascinating! I wonder how exactly they tested this. So I asked Gemma to summarize the experimental setup in a few bullet points. And the model describes the key aspects of the experimental procedure. I find the results of this study quite remarkable. So I asked Gemma, does any of the other papers describe surprising animal behavior? Oh, there is a paper that studies playful behavior in great apes. Let's look at it in more detail. Since Gemma 3 is also multimodal, it can help me understand the diagrams in this paper. I pass a few plots to the model, and it provides very clear explanations of what they show in the context of the paper. As the last thing, I want to ask Gemma to summarize the papers. And the model does an excellent job in finding the overall theme and important takeaways of these studies. I would also like to share the summary with my family, so I will ask the model to translate it. And that's it. The Gemma 3 model was able to analyze more than 70,000 tokens of scientific literature. And thanks to this, I was able to quickly learn what all these papers are about. You can try this workflow yourself. See the link in the description below to ask your own questions about these papers. Mm -hmm.